Wrestling Rampage back with another video. That's right. We are doing the NXT TakeOver Brooklyn prediction video. Uh, our predictions on, uh, well, the match is already set uh, for, the, as we know of right now, uh, going in four or five days before the pay-per-view. Uh, so far, uh, six matches are uh, signed for NXT TakeOver Brooklyn. Um, uh, before we get started with our predictions of who's going to win and who's going to lose and all that stuff, uh, like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash Rampage 2 Follow us on Twitter at Rampage, and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, we do prediction videos, reviews, DVD reviews, anything that goes on with wrestling, unboxings, uh, WWE shop unboxings, uh, uh, eBay unboxings, whatever. You're going to see it right here on Wrestling Rampage. Um, so, uh, back to NXT TakeOver Brooklyn. It's going to be held August 22nd, 2015, uh, at the Barclays Center, uh, in Brooklyn, New York. And this is going to be the day before Wrestle, sorry, the day before SummerSlam 2015. Um, and, uh, all we know of right now, uh, is uh, Apollo Crow's debut. Yep, in NXT TakeOver Brooklyn. Uh, I've been seeing a lot of vignettes on the guy. And uh, it looks like he's going to be pretty good. So, uh, and I like his theme. I was born a champion. You know that? Yeah, the hard work and the dedication. Yeah. Uh, That's a pretty good thing if he comes after that. Yeah, I uh, don't know who he's facing right now, but uh, we it's know that It's just his in-ring debut. All we know is his, his debut is going to be at NXT TakeOver Brooklyn. But I especially he'd probably take on a jobber. So uh, I'm just going to say right here I'm going for Apollo Crow. So. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm also going to go with Apollo Crows too. So uh, Next match is uh, Samoa Joe versus Baron Corbin. Well, I'm going for the Samoan submission machine, Samoa Joe. I thought he was the Samoan specialist or something. Well, or, I or remember Smith his TNA so. run, so I say Samoan submission machine. But I'm going for Samoa Joe. Uh, I just don't like Baron Corbin. Never have. His matches are too short. He's taken all. All he's been taken. The only one that fucking he took on was any talent was Rhino. All the rest have been a bunch of ham and eggers. Yes, they have been. And uh, and uh, I thought Rhino was going to finally give him give his motherfucker his first loss, but no. And but Samoa Joe put him away. He'll he'll choke his ass out like he did last week. So uh, I'm going for Samoa Joe. Uh, I am also going to go with Samoa Joe. Uh, next match is for the NXT Tag Team Titles. Uh, when uh, the champions Blake and Murphy take on the VOD villains, Aiden English and Simon Gotch. Well, I'm going for Alexa Bliss and uh, Blake and Murphy. Uh, I'm sorry, I think the VOD villains suck. That's just me. I'd rather see Blake and Murphy hold on to those titles. So. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not a big fan of the VOD villains myself. Uh, Blake and Murphy are a pretty good tag team. Yes, they are. Uh, but uh, uh, my favorite's Alexa Bliss. She's hot. She, she is hot. She's she's definitely hot. She's drop dead gorgeous. I'll bear. So, uh, sorry about that. Anyway, I'm just uh, 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 we both agree. So far, we both agree on all this so far. So we believe that Blake and Murphy are going to retain their NXT tag team titles. Yeah, I hope uh, so. Next match is uh, for the NXT Women's Championship match. Uh, when uh, Bailey uh, gets a shot at Sasha Banks. Well, uh, since Sasha Banks is moving on to bigger and better things, she's going on Raw. So uh, I'm going to say I'm going for Bailey. I hope Sasha Banks keeps the NXT title. Uh, so you're the, going the, for the Sasha. Members. I like Sasha Banks. Don't get me wrong. I well, like Sasha. If they're going to drop it to a girl, don't drop it to Bailey. Drop it to somebody else. I think it'll be Bailey here. So. That's what I'm thinking. So that's why I'm going for Bailey in this match. I'm not a big fan of her. I don't like the whole hug thing. Uh, she's good for the kids, it is. But, uh, well, may maybe for the kids. You know, for the kids. Okay. But I'm going for Bailey. So you're going for Sasha Banks? I'm going to go with Sasha Banks. Right. I uh, like Sasha Banks. But 
Next match is oh god, this is this is going to be a good match. Uh, j just by seeing it, uh, you know, added to the card, uh, you can already tell it's going to be a good match. Um, Tyler Breeze versus Jushin Thunder Liger uh, yes. from New Japan Pro Wrestling. Uh, I'm going for Jushin Thunder Liger. Um, you know, uh, you better gear up your frequent flyer mileages, as uh, as Eric Bischoff likes to say. Well, I'm going for Jushin Thunder Liger. Biker? Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, I th I, it, the the whole build-up to this was actually pretty uh, pretty great. You know, Liger. Uh, Tyler Breeze, you know, saying that, you know. He, he wants wa some competition. He wants competition. William Real gave him competition. Jushin Thunder Liger. Uh, by so. bringing in New Japan Pro Wrestling's uh, Jushin Thunder Liger. Who, Who's a legend. Who is a legend. Uh, no doubt about it. And I'm also going to go with Jushin Thunder Liger. Yes. Uh, now, uh, I don't know if they're actually going to put over Liger or if they're going to put over Breeze. Yeah, but I'm still going for Jushin Thunder Liger. Uh, but uh, all I can say is the match is going to be fucking great. Yes. Uh, that I already know. But uh, uh, Liger, Liger... Uh, and then um, the main event the main event of NXT TakeOver Brooklyn is uh, the rematch uh, from Beast in the East from Beast in the East it's a ladder match for the NXT Championship when the champion Finn Balor takes on the ex-former uh, NXT champion Kevin Owens I'm going for Finn Balor uh, for those of you that know I am a big Owens fan but, I am too uh, but I'm going for Finn Balor. But I am going to go with Owens uh, because uh, I've seen his, uh, who he's going to be facing at SummerSlam. And uh, I think he's getting the wrong treatment, to be honest with you, in the WWE. Uh, like, I, I think them getting uh, the, the NXT uh, wrestlers getting switched to... WWE, a lot of them have failed. And, uh, Look at the Ascension. Yeah, the Ascension failed big time. Uh, Adam Rose failed, failed big, big time. time. Um, uh, so far, it's just... I don't know. Uh, you know, yes, he was a big fish in a small pond in NXT, but now he's on to the WWE. But... Uh, I, I'm going to go with Owens to get it back. but uh, yeah, I'm going for Finn Balor. Finn Balor's great, though. Uh, and this match is also going to steal the show, too. Yep. Um, no doubt about it. Um, that, uh, and uh, actually, uh, NXT TakeOver Brooklyn is a day before SummerSlam 2015. So you're getting two shows. You're getting two shows over, over the weekend. Um, Saturday and, and Sunday. Yeah, Saturday and Sunday. Uh, and there's two, uh, there's two wrestlers from the NXT show that are that are that are doing double duty. That's going to be on uh, SummerSlam. Yeah. Sasha Banks and Kevin Owens. Yeah. So they're going to be pulling double duty. So we'll see how that goes. But that was the NXT uh, Takeover Brooklyn predictions. Uh, if you don't agree with us. Tell uh, us who you think will win. Tell us who do you think will win down in the comments and let us know all how. these matches. Yes. Um, uh, thank you for your comments, your posts, your shares, uh, writing us, telling us, uh, comments, everything. Thank you so much. Uh, like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash Russell Rampage 2. Follow us on Twitter at Russell Rampage and also. Make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel. We got some more great videos coming up for you uh, in the near future. And have a great day. See ya.